Can't wait till winter so I can really start dressing. Steve Jobs mentality. What is up, everyone on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well today. It's winter time. I've accumulated some new outerwear and I thought I'd incorporate it into an outfit video featuring how much is your outfit, Giorgio, and Ferdinand. Let's begin with outfit number one. For the first fit, we're gonna start with the jacket. Now this was actually provided to me by the great Fernando Rangel. It is a Ralph Simmons parachute bomber jacket from spring summer 2006. It has an exaggerated fit, raglan sleeves. The collar has a hood that comes out, but I think it looks better with the collar in the hood. Underneath it, I'm gonna be wearing this hoodie that I'm already wearing. I got it in a challenge video that's coming out, but it's really just like a vintage Carhartt hoodie. Probably fake, the Carhartt logo is a little, little sus. Obviously, when it's cold, you gotta wear a hat. So for the beanie, I'm wearing this Snow Peak insulated beanie. Snow Peak is a Japanese brand that kind of specializes in hiking gear, outerwear. It's padded. I like how it's different material than just like the standard black beanie. I really didn't know what to wear for the pants of this fit just because the jacket is so wide. Kind of settled on a pair of pants that you guys have seen. They're this Arc'teryx shell pants. Winter time is really the only appropriate time to wear these. For the final component, ROA Elite's hiking boots. Because these are so chunky, I think they go good with the Arc'teryx pants. All together, kind of a chunky black fit. Here's what it looks like all together. <laughs> Fit number two, we're also gonna start with the jacket. I'm gonna be wearing Helmet Lang Anorak Puffer. I believe this came out in 98. It features this big flap on the front that has a little hidden zipper in it. Each side also has zips so you can easily put it on. And on top it has this little zipper and then this big kind of like neck flap. I'm really happy with it. Under the jacket, I decided to go with a pair of vintage 505 orange tab Levi's. These are in a dark gray wash and then they have a released hem. That's what's going under the jacket. For the boots, I decided to go with these ground cover, forget the name. Big shout out to Avery. I'm starting to wear these more, especially in the winter time, and I really like this chunky lug sole and this buttery pineapple leather. To end this fit, I was gonna throw on my Alix beanie, but I put it in the wash. Now it's a beanie for a small child. I'm debating between bringing this Stussy beanie out of retirement or wearing this Nike ACG reversible beanie. This is the fit all together. Here we go. <laughs> I know this video is getting kind of boring, so we're gonna switch to Trevor's fits, and then we're gonna take it to the office and do a huge outfit bonanza. Here we go. All right, dude, so we're filming our right, winter right, fits right, slash winter essentials. First pickup, Gorilla Glue. Sniffing it. Obviously some Carhartt pants. <laughs> this is what I've been wearing every day. A hoodie and then a work jacket over. I think it's a Dickies jacket, some jeans or pants, okay. or a fleece, or a fleece. But a hoodie under something. Can't no. wait till winter so I can really start dressing. Let's say it gets hot. Hmm? Right. Someone asked me, I really need some good beanie recommendations. Neff. I'm not even lying. Neff. I have like a $2 <laughs> beanie. I think, I don't know where it is. People need to know. You ain't never seen this before. Oh, damn. FedEx clear. Trevor finally found the beanie. <laughs> it's just a black beanie made in USA. Wool or acrylic? Uh, I would check the tag, but... Which one do you recommend? I don't even know what it is. This is a good fit. We have a jacket layered under a hoodie. Feel different, man. I've been cooking, you know. Winter fit. How much is your outfit? Uh, sorry. Rashawn Richardson. Got a capital jacket with some wool lining, pretty warm. Got some Levi's 501XX and some New Balance 574s. I got pajamas underneath. That's a pro winner tip. Okay, this is Lucas. This is his best fit ever. Carol Christian Palel, right for the winter. Are these snow proof? Yes. Helmet Lang. Helmet Lang, disposable parka. Dude, I give it a, a 7 out of 10. Damn. This is good. This is Nathan Kotler, John's enthusiast. Great job. Acquire her. Guidi hiking boots. Oh wow. Silver League socks. Stotzbalet. Canvas pants. Acronym J5 jacket. 
And of course, inside out too. Tape seam, waterproof zippers. You can stick your AirPods to the jacket. Um, Shout out to Arelson Hugh. This is Francis Barrera. Carol, like the folded drip derbies. Marcel Everett, taxi trousers. This is a 50s Belgian shirt. Paul Harden, hopscotch, short Mako, Kubo Rum. Classes. Would you describe your style as peasant core? 300 IQ winter fit. The winter fit on the feet. Weedy. On the pants. Saint Laurent. D17. The hoodie. The Gix. Shades. Soberly really example. 711. Beanie. This is Jack Greenberg. Brought out the best winter <laughs> shoes. Laser cut derbies. Very practical for the rain. Helmet, wool trousers. Deep D knit, deep D coat. That's it. Weedy 795B. This is the unsound denim sample. Got a vintage crew neck. Been wearing this for like three months. RAF Auto Winter 02 Virginia Creeper varsity jacket. We just bought this entire compound. 10 out of 10 fit, obviously because it's RAF. <laughs> no, I wear the same fit every single day. Just because that whole Steve Jobs mentality. Welcome back, everyone. It's time for the final fit, and we're starting it with the jacket. This is from the brand Ann Wander. It's a Japanese outdoor and hiking brand. I've been eyeing this fleece for a while. They make it in some really nice colors and I ended up getting it in this green colorway. What drew me to it was the combination of fleece and nylon. I think they pair really well together. I'll go a little bit more in depth on this in the next pickups video, but this is what's going on top. Underneath it, I'm keeping it pretty basic. I'm gonna wear this pair of vintage single knee Carhartts in a gray colorway. For the hat, I'm going for this Arcteryx beanie in a brown and yellow colorway. Big shout out to Dick Owens for hooking it up. It's kind of a meme, but I think it really completes the Gorp outfit. And last but not least for the shoes, I'm wearing this pair of Solomon XT Quest. This shoe has held up better than any other shoe I've ever owned. In my opinion, it has a really nice look. So this is what that fit looks like all together. Can't wait till Can't winter so I can really start to press it. What is good YouTube? Merry Christmas, Fernando here. I'm back with another video. There were a lot of fits in this video. Most of them were bad. Nonetheless, they were winter fits. So if you guys have any other video recommendations or anything for me, please let me know in the comments. I appreciate you all so much for watching. Thank you for supporting the short drop. There'll be more content soon. Thanks for sticking with me. I love you all. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out everybody and take care.